Hey, hey, collective. It's your girl Stacy here with the Terrascopes. Remember that time is fluid, so whenever you see this message, it's when you're meant to see it. It's a general reading, and it may not resonate with everyone, so please only take what resonates and leave the rest. And last but not least, I think it's Aries. Let's see. I know it is, right? Let's say, come on, spirit. It flew right out. <laughs> Aries, you're up, baby. And the last should be first, and the first should be last. Number one could be significant, Aries. Let's see what's going on here. My Aries, what we got here? We got the sun. There go your energy again. This is about yourself. Okay. Oh, can I get one more, please, for my Aries spirit? <clears throat> can I get one more for Aries, please, and thank you. Okay, we got Saturn, karma. All right, Aries. Okay. Aries, rebellious. Aries, we got the sun here. This is about you, your energy, okay? 13 could be significant. 31, 1, 19, and 91. But there's definitely karma about to be served, okay? Now, what side of karma are you on? You should know by the seeds that you planted, right? You know what you put out is what you should expect back, okay? Uh, yeah, the sun. I feel like you're very intuitive. You know what, Aries? I feel like you're very spiritual and very intuitive. I feel like you have a lot of uh, gifts that I, that you try to keep hidden. You try to keep that hidden. You try to keep control over it, as you should. But I feel like you're very powerful. Okay? Very powerful. And look at these. It's like you have antenna on your head. You know what I'm saying? Where you pick up. A lot of um, messages. You're very intuitive. Okay, what is this Saturn? Yeah, because I feel like Sama's Sama, Sama's being served. You know, that's for everybody. You know what I mean? And what you put out, like I said, is what you get back. And I feel like you're being served. You're about to be given something on a platter, and I don't feel like it's bad. I feel like you're about to be served. Something's about to be handed to you on a platter. You're going to feel like that. Okay, Spirit, what's this message? What's this message for my Aries? What's going on with my Aries, Spirit? What's this message? You may feel like something is going to take a miracle to happen. <sighs> Two of Wands. I feel like you may, you had to make a decision or you're going to need to make a decision. All right. And it's, I don't know if this has got to do with light and dark. The light and dark energy or what's this? Seven of Pentacles. What you invest in. Mm. Uh, you know what? Now that I'm getting this with you trying to hide your, your powers, your spiritual abilities, it's like I feel like you, you, you're you at like a crossroads on how you want to move forward. Are you going to lean more to the light side? Are you going to lean more to the, to the dark side? It's like you know that wherever you invest your time, that's where your focus will be. So I feel like right at this point, you're very careful to invest equally, okay? Maybe you feel like you're not investing in a part of yourself that may be a little on the darker side. I don't know because you have an option. You have a choice here in what you're going to invest in. And, you, and, and if I look at it at another angle, I feel like, yeah, you got a choice be, between choosing it. Ah, thank you, spirit. Remember I said it's karma time. So when you had the choice to, to choose what you were going to invest in, that's what's about to come out, all right? So whatever choice you made to invest in, that's what's coming out, whether it be dark or whether it be light. Thank you, Spirit. That's confirmation. Ooh, we got the Ten of Swords. Aries, what have you been doing? Did you betray someone just to get a victory? Well, somebody did. Somebody invested in betraying somebody, putting ten swords in their back. Look, Aries, did you? For a four of wands, for some kind of commitment? Or to get some kind of victory or control over a family? 
over some kind of union, some kind of household where somebody was building. You wanted victory, so you betrayed someone. Wow. What's the Six of Pentacles, Ace of Cups? Unequal give and take. Penny pitching. Um, bread crumbing. Wow. What's going on here? Did somebody do this to you? Take Listen, chaos, conflict, and confusion. Yeah, somebody's ashamed of what they invested in to win. Yes, they did. They Somebody wanted control by any means necessary. Mm -hmm. Over a family, over a four wands, over the family, the husband, the wife, the children. Somebody wanted total control over everybody. Listen, here it come again. Split it again. Y'all see me sitting up here shuffling? Ten of wands. Somebody invested... And sabotaging another. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. Ooh, we Aries, what is going on here? Ah, <sighs> boy. Mm, somebody was a busy bee. Mm hmm. Driving them stakes in somebody's back like it was nobody's business. Mm hmm. What is this? Seven of Wands. And what else we got? Ace of Pentacles. Wow. Nine of Wands. Mm, 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 mm. Seven of Wands guarded. I mean, um, defending. Defensive. Trying to. Ace of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands. Somebody's protected with the seven of wands. Whatever whatever people were looking for or trying to do, it, it definitely has something to do with money. With this ace of pentacles, and this ace of pentacles, it's not just about finances. It's, it's about having wish fulfillment. It's about having stability. It's about having, you know, like a, a, a nest egg, egg that's gonna that you've been saving so you can have a fresh start. This is your ace of pentacles. And, it's, and it was guarded. It was very much so protected. With the seven of wands. Mm-hmm. Nine of wands. That's that guarded energy again. Protecting what's yours. Ten of cups. Wow. Mm. Yeah, look. Somebody wanted to tear up your ten of cups. Somebody wanted to cause conflict, chaos, and confusion in your ten of cups, in your wish fulfillment, in your emotional fulfillment. They wanted to take that away from you. Somebody wanted to be, damn, I'm here. Somebody wanted to be in charge of your fucking happiness. How people love you. How people see you in a family dynamic. Somebody wanted to be the head. Damn, it's still coming out. Ten of Wands. Look, lovers. There it is. The lovers. Man, listen, don't let me find out. Let's see what else is going on in the spirit. Wow. Hey, karma's here for whatever this is. Whoever, whoever was in this energy, Aries is this is you. <laughs> you already know. And if there's somebody around you, you already know. You know, ain't nothing you need to do because the universe takes care of its own, baby. I promise. <laughs> yes, sir. No matter how good or bad we are, the universe got us. All right, we've been bad. The universe gonna spank that ass. I look at that six of pentacles again. Breadcrumb and taken from you. I'm I'm here. Quid pro quo. You do something for me, then I'll do something for you. Mm, that's what I heard. Look, Queen of Swords speaking the truth. That's what I heard. Somebody listen. The death card. Mm-hmm. This got to go. This got to end. Yeah, this is this is coming to an end. And somebody knows the truth as well. Somebody knows that this is coming to an end. Whatever all this chaos and conflict was that was created, whatever somebody was putting in a, so much work into to, to drive these stakes in somebody's back, to, 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 I'm, I'm literally seeing like somebody being nailed down and unable to move. Somebody could even be playing with a voodoo doll, I heard. Thank you, Spirit. Listen, I'm telling you what I was just shown. All right? Somebody putting nails in somebody to keep them from being able to move. 
so that they could have victory over their family, over their possessions, over what they were building. Thank you, Spirit. Mm-hmm. And their Ace of Pentacles. Somebody wanted somebody's life. Period. King of Cups. The Tower. The Knight of Cups. Mm, mm, mm. The Hermit. You about to be shown. King of Cups, the Tower, and the Knight of Cups. So there's going to be some kind of transformation that happens. It could be some kind of uh, fallout between two people that you're going to you're gonna see. Mm -hmm. We got a king and a knight. So this could be an older, a older person and a younger person. Could be um, at conflict or at odds with each other. Yeah, because somebody's starting to see what somebody did to cause conflict in their life. Somebody's starting to see what somebody did. Somebody's been exposed to cause conflict and imbalance in somebody's life. You hear me? Mm -hmm. Cause somebody to want to turn away, to, to go in a new direction. And this is justice, I'm telling you. Confirmation. There it is. All right, Aries, look. Page of Wands, here comes the message. Here comes the message. Aries, it could be you bringing this message. I don't know. Take it how it resonates. Let me get some more here. Let me see what's going on here. Um, do I want the romance? No, I don't want romance. Because this ain't no happy situation. We're going to get the Kippa and see what's going on here. We're going to get the Kippa. Spirit, what's this? What's going on here with my Aries? Yeah. Mm hmm. Somebody about to find out. Somebody's about to see exactly what somebody's been doing to cause conflict and chaos and to break up this this family dynamic, this union, this whatever this these connections were. Somebody did this on purpose. <clears throat> we got poverty in reverse. Somebody wanted somebody to lose everything. I told you somebody wanted somebody's life. Yeah, what's this message? They wanted to destroy everything about someone. Mm -mm -mm, that's crazy. High honor. Yep, this is somebody that's held in high honor. They want, listen, this is what somebody else wanted. I can't make it up. They wanted to be held in high honor. You see me? They wanted to be held in high honor. Thank you, spirit. We got a house that came out in reverse. Somebody could be losing their home. What else? Mm, we got sudden wealth. Somebody could be coming into some wealth. Hmm. Wow. Let's see what we got here. We got child in reverse and we got mature man. Look, we already got the king of cups and the knight of cups. We got child and mature man in reverse. Mature man and child in reverse. Yep, they're thieves. I can't make it up. I cannot make it up. Somebody could have been using a child as a distraction. Main female in reverse. Yes. Mm-hmm. Distant horizons. Mm-hmm. Great fortune. Yeah, they thought they was going to get this great fortune, and they were going to be able to go and do whatever they wanted to do. Distant horizons. But they're going to find out. It's time to pay the piper. Karma is here. Remember those seeds. Look, from the beginning, remember those seeds you planted. What choice did you make? What? Where was you investing your time, in the dark or in the light? All right. Then, then you should not be surprised at the outcome, right? Right. All right, y'all. Deuces.